Good morning! So I decided that I want to go for a walk slash run today. I've already done my face, threw my hair in a ponytail, and I just threw on this outfit. Yeah. We need to get you dressed. <gasps> Why you got a tear? <laughs> yeah, what you want to say? Yeah. Dad, that doesn't work. So let's get him dressed and then we're going to go to the lake. Um, they have a nice trail around the lake and then I'm just going to get some water, get us some snackies. I'm going to grab my Bible because I feel like today is a perfect day to just sit outside and read my Bible and catch up and let's get to it. Okay, let's go. <laughs> We're being very simple today. Um, plain white t-shirt. We're getting me back into the hang of running. Um, I used to be a sprinter, so definitely not doing that because I don't want to make myself sick. But <laughs> I know you're hungry. I know. I know. That's something you got from me. You get hangry. I know. Come on, stick your arm through there. You got it. Good job, Bubba Bear. Good job. Hey! Hey! Yeah. I have a very rambunctious one, almost one year old. Did you stop moving? And then just some basic little basketball shorts. This is very uh, athletic. <laughs> These shirts low. Look. <laughs> they might as well be capris. They might as well be pants. That's okay, son. You wanna play with this while I'll do your hair real quick? Yeah, let's stitch. She said, mwah, mwah, mwah. Yeah. Older, older mothers, older black mothers don't come for me. I'm not putting no socks on him, it's hot. It's hot, we're gonna be outside. You don't need no socks on his feet, it's hot. Spray bottle, oil, live. That's all we need. I'm actually not going to put his hair back in a ponytail. I'm just gonna let it be today. He actually has a lot of hair on top, but it's, we're waiting on it to even out on the sides so until then we've been using we've been using this oil for growth honestly since he was about six months i think i'll say yes it's grown but not as much as i wanted to to be honest see he don't know how good he got it somebody to moisturize his scalp wait on him hand and foot Got a, little, got a little hot top on. Okay, we will be outside and he does have a little bit of allergies, so just gonna give him his allergy medication. He likes it, it tastes like grape. Stand up for what you believe in. Stand up for what you want. Mm hmm that's good. One thing I got from my mom, one thing he got from me, allergies. That's what I call a generational curse. We'll just talk about that. Holding my hand while you take your medicine. Okay. I wish you would tilt your head back more because you're dripping it on the floor. Yeah, like tilt your head back. Just, just a little tiny bit more like this. Like, ah, like that. Yeah, here, let me help you. Tilt, tilt your head back. I'm going to make him some food, um, make me some water, and I'll probably grab that trail mix just in case I feel a little snacky. Um, yeah, and then we're gonna get out the house. I've been trying to get out the house now for probably 30 minutes. So yeah, let's do it.
okay. It literally took me an hour and 15. It took me an hour and 15 minutes just to get out the house. Um, but we're out the house, so no, no complaints, no complaints. Um, heading to the lake now. I did bring some sunscreen, my Bible. Uh, we got the stroller that stays in the trunk faithfully. And yeah, now I can just go see what kind of running I got in me. Um, I'm excited because I, I just, I really forgot how much I used to run, how much I used to like running. So I'm going to take it slow. I got to remember that I'm not high school me whatsoever. Um, I'm almost 28. I'm post, post baby me. And that is going to be a reality check. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. I don't know how long I'm gonna be out here. Uh -uh. It's hot. It's beautiful. It's beautiful today. But the sun is beaming. I did just put on some sunscreen. So I'm gonna put these on and we're gonna we're gonna see what we can do. Oh, baby, it's hot. Let me I'm gonna turn his fan on. Hold on. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm out of shape, but that's that's to be expected, baby. You know, I'm really trying to still lose this stomach. Um, I'm on that journey. I found out about apron stomachs, and I self-diagnosed and said I had one. So I'm doing a little cool down right now, uh, but I'm finna get back to it. He's smiling at me and stuff, so it's keeping me motivated to keep going. Okay, here we go. Okay, we've made it this far to the restaurant area. Um, big goofy. I actually stopped here because there's, it's shade, but also because I forgot to start stretching before I did this. So, yeah, we're doing good though. Doing good. He got his juice water. I just drank some water. Okay, let's get back to it. I'm turning around here though. I'm not going any further. This I have a I have a long trek back to the car. I don't even know if y'all can hear me. And I and I and I knew better. It's too hot. I knew better. Getting down there was no problem. Getting back was the problem. Air is on full blast. I I I remote started the car before I even when I got it within range. I look how I feel. Um, I feel good. Actually, I'm gonna take that back. I'm gonna take that back. I feel good, okay? And yes, I'm sweaty, but I feel good, I got out. So now I feel like ready to eat healthy and tackle the rest of the day. Um, mind you, I've been up since 4.53 a.m. I couldn't go back to sleep. Um, so yeah, let's let's finish the rest of our our Sunday. I don't know if y'all can tell, his shirt is soaked. Soaked. Because I gave him something to drink on our run. Yeah. And you look like you just been playing in water. So let me get him situated. Then I will figure out my lunch, which is probably a smoothie. And then um, I already have ideas for dinner. So let's do it. Okay. So he's changed. Um, I would very much love to take a shower, but he's yelling he, because he wants to E-A-T. I'm not going to say it because then he'll start saying it. Yeah, he wants to E-A-T again. So I'm going to get him situated and then I can get me situated. I'm getting a karate chop to the throat. You wanna watch Snoop Dogg show? Turn it up, turn it up, turn it up. Um, we're gonna thaw out these tenderloins and then this ground turkey and let's go make something. I think I wanna make some shrimp. Uh, flip that TV slot, hold on. Okay, 
I have some shrimp in there that I need to cook. His dad doesn't eat shrimp, so don't fool me. Um, the tenderloins and the shrimp, I'll do like teriyaki shrimp and chicken bowls with some rice and some broccoli. Um, I really love doing Sunday dinners, but I'm slowly starting to realize that that involves a lot of cooking for me. Um, it also involves just, I just want to set us up for the week and not like focus all my energy on one meal. So I'm going to meal prep. Um, we'll see how long it lasts because we eat baby. <laughs> we like to eat. Yeah, and then I got this ground turkey. Um, honestly, it's, it's, it's given like tacos, some taco meat um, with that. Uh, but that's only like two meals, so I honestly should thaw out something else. That was only one pack of tenderloins, so I'm going to thaw out another pack of tenderloins. And hopefully I can make like a lot of bowls of this chicken teriyaki and rice. And that'll be like meals for... Uh, Monday and Wednesday and then like Taco Tuesday we're gonna see um, and then I have some plantains and some sweet potatoes uh, that I need to cook up for him because these purees ain't doing it no more they're not doing it no more he Okay, got in the shower. Um, yes. Uh oh, uh oh, you okay? <laughs> I really want to wash my hair, but I have a trip coming up, and I want it to be an all like one stop shop. So I have to wait a little bit longer to wash my hair, and then I'll do a retwist, and then I'll do a style. Um, there'll be a video on that, um, but now I can finally figure out what the heck I want to eat. My face started tingling, and I should have never sprayed that sunscreen on my face. Um, yeah, I, I, I mean, I know I needed to use sunscreen, but it, it, it didn't have to be what I used. Um, so yeah, let's, let me go get some food, because I'm really hungry. Okay.
so here I am getting the bowls prepped for our meal preps. The glass ones are for me and then the black ones are for him. It's just easier so that we know which ones to divvy up and then he can just grab it when he goes to work. But as you can see, I put the shrimp in mine and then I am divvying up the chicken into his. Um, unfortunately, I did not have enough rice to do a lot of chicken teriyaki bowls. So I only had enough to do two bowls for him and two bowls for me, but that's fine because I ended up doing a different meal for the rest of the chicken that I had. But I use boil in a bag rice. I don't know if it's good. I don't know if it's bad. I don't really wanna know. I just know it's easy for me to cook it and open it up and then go ahead and pour it and divvy it up into the bowls. So I did some brown rice for me. And then once we were out of brown rice, I did have enough to do a bag of white rice for him, which worked out because I'm trying to eat healthier anyways. Then once I finished divvying those up, I went ahead and added some broccoli. Oh my gosh, y'all don't understand that after I had baby and I wasn't able to eat broccoli because we just found out that it gave him so much gas, it hurt his stomach so bad. So I wasn't able to eat broccoli, honestly, for like 10 months. But now we're back in the broccoli game and there's some teriyaki sauce, store-bought, nothing fancy. This is to make it easier on myself. And then I just drizzle some of that teriyaki on these bowls that we have here and voila, chicken teriyaki bowls with rice and broccoli. And now we're able to eat that for the next couple of days. So for the rest of the chicken that I had, I just cooked up a can of green beans and a can of corn and that was the third meal that we had and then I have some mashed potatoes here plantains and then some sweet potatoes for baby and then over here in this container that's that ground turkey that you see me dicing up all I did was add some taco seasoning to it and voila you now have taco meat to make some hard shell tacos soft shell tacos whatever you need the meat is already ready to go. And then there's that chicken and corn and green bean meal that I just was talking about. Now his room is forever dirty, okay? I get it, he's almost one. But like this little person, all he does is pull stuff off the shelves and pull toys out of the toy basket. But I purposely put the books up there like that so that he can pull them down because I like to keep him entertained as much as possible, so. I put him within his reach. I actually don't mind going in here and cleaning up after him because he's having fun. Now I'm just getting some pajamas set out so that I can get ready to give him a bath. But here's his room all nice and clean before he destroys it again. And I'm gonna let that last for about one minute. But that is the most productivity that I have done in a while gonna end off the night by just spending some time with God getting my word in because I did not do that at the park it was too hot if you can remember but I like to highlight some key points and we are all done here thank you guys so much for watching this video see you next time bye